You've probably heard of the nanny cam or a pet cam. Well, now there's something called a drop cam. It's a home surveillance system that lets you watch what's going on from your phone or tablet. Shelby Costo explains how it works. The nanny seen here throwing objects at a baby and slapping him in the head are pictures hard to watch. It's any parent's worst nightmare. Disturbing videos like these have more families turning to home surveillance to keep their children safe. <coughs> One of the latest gadgets out there is called Drop Cam. It lets you keep an eye on your kids and lets you watch the video live from your computer, your cell phone, or your tablet. The nice thing is just for me, when I'm at work, I can uh, peek in on him when he's taking a nap and whatnot. Seth and Tabitha Green live in Huber Heights and have two young boys. They like the idea of always having an extra set of eyes on their babies. It's just nice to be able to see what's going on in the room. And if he just woke up, if he fell out of the crib, because he's getting almost to that stage. Camera is about the size of my hand and needs to be plugged in. It's only sold online right now for 150 bucks. A little pricey, but some parents say their peace of mind is priceless. They could get out of the crib and touch an outlet or get something in their mouth that they shouldn't have in their mouth. So it's just nice to actually be able to see what they're doing. Drop cam can also be used to watch over your home. The last thing in the world you'd want to see is something like this, a burglar trying to break in when you are at work or on vacation. The fact that it um, is triggered by motion is nice because we could see if something was going on or especially if we, we travel um, more than an hour away a lot. So um, it'd be nice to be able to see that when we're gone. In Huber Heights, I'm Shelby Costo for ABC 22 News. That is definitely a great tool for parents. Now the downside of drop cam, you can watch it live. Um, the, you can watch it live, that's the good part, but in order to record video, you actually have to pay extra for a DVR plan. I hope